Come on, Mr. Burns, keep moving. We can't leave work till you do. Oh, no, he's talking to that mailroom guy. I hope he's not telling that stupid story about hang gliding again. Oh! Listen carefully. I have taken your wife hostage. If you don't have a wife, I have kidnapped your brother. Not if you understand. Now, back away from Burns, and I will let your dog live. Good. Now stop and dance like a happy prospector. Happier. 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 Homer, we want to get him away from Burns. Oh, right. Just leave. But kick like a rocket. <laughs> Yes! We're free! Empty apartment, here I come! Set the table, Marge. I can already taste those deep-fried pork chops. Don't you remember what today is? Oh, when you ask me that, it's never good. It's the first of the month, the day you promised to start your new diet. Mm -hmm. I'm just really worried about your weight. Bart says that we got a call from NASA, and your gravity is pulling satellites out of their orbit. Marge, that was a joke. But it comes from a true place. Oh. Well, if I'm gonna start a diet, this is my last chance to eat all the crap I love. I think I'll miss you most of all, Captain Corndog Schnitzel Palace. No tears, Homer. Can't let Mart see this. Thank you! <gasps> A drive-up trash can! This must be how the rich toss out their gold. And as long as I'm cleaning out the family chariot... Cups! Newspapers! Bottles! Tricycle! Lawn chair! Uncashed checks! Trip, trip, trip. Hmm, dispose of proper... Oh, this book is too hard! Now for a victory cigar. Thank you! The calamity in our fast food district destroyed 37 restaurants rated awful to mediocre and put these beloved mascots out on the street. <laughs> I told myself I'd stay strong. <laughs> there, there, cheesy McMayer. No one likes weepy meat. I can't stand it. See a grown burger cry. We must rebuild fast food boulevard. I don't know about you. But I don't want to live in a future where food is brought by waiters, where the chairs aren't attached to the tables, and where I can't ditch my kids in a pit of dirty balls. I say we rebuild the fast food district bigger and better than ever! Yay! To raise the money, we'll need a bond issue. But won't that just shift the burden to your children? No, you idiot. We just pay for it with another bond issue. Let her figure out something to dump it on. Then it's decided. The bond issue will be part of our next scheduled election, the Springfield presidential primary. But that's not till next June. In that case, I hereby move the election up to next Tuesday. Yay! That means the Springfield's presidential primary will be first in the nation, even earlier than New Hampshire. Uh-oh, they're gonna be cheesed. 